Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what is the main difference between scenario and scenario outline? Let me answer. First of all, the scenario and scenario outline are the Gherkin language keywords that we generally use for creating the feature files in Cucumber projects. But what is the difference? If you create a scenario in a feature file with this scenario keyword, then that scenario is going to run only one time, okay, no matter what. Whereas if you create a scenario with scenario outline, then this scenario has a possibility of running multiple times, the same scenario running multiple times, depending on how many sets of data are available or mentioned or specified under the examples keyword, okay? With scenario outline keyword, another keyword will be accompanying it, that is examples keyword. Under this examples keyword of the scenario outline, you will mention the number of sets of data, like uh, three sets of data, four sets of data, like that, okay? Depending on how many sets of data you are mentioning under this examples keyword of the scenario outline scenario, that scenario is going to run that many number of times. If you provide three sets of data, scenario outline scenario is going to run three times. If you are going to specify five sets of data under the examples keyword of the scenario outline scenario, then scenario is going to run five times. But the scenario which is created with the normal scenario keyword will run only one time, okay? You cannot specify multiple sets of data there. Let me practically show you that. For that, I'll switch to this Eclipse ID where I'll take you to one of the feature file that is login.feature file in this Cucumber project or framework. And uh, if you see this normal scenario first, okay? You see which Gherkin language keyword is provided? Scenario, okay? So you cannot specify multiple sets of data here for this particular scenario. And this scenario, if you run, it will run only one time, okay? This particular scenario is going to run only one time. Whereas, I'll show you practically, okay? I'll show you practically. I'll go to the runner class, test runner. And here I'll mention the tax, tax is equal to, so that I can run a particular scenario. So I would like to run only this scenario. Uh, that is uh, the scenario having this tag, no other scenario has this particular tag. So only that particular scenario will run when I run this, okay? Rightly run as, okay, when I run it like this, whatever the scenario that is going to run is going to run only one time, okay? Because that is a normal scenario specified with Gherkin language keyword known as scenario keyword. You see, it got only run one time. Okay, it got run only one time. If you go here and see whether it got passed or failed doesn't matter, but it has run only one time. Okay. Now, what I'll do here is I'll take you to another one. This is scenario outline. Okay, there is a scenario outline and which is accompanying with another keyword known as examples. Under the examples, three sets of data are provided. Now, if you run this kind of scenario, this scenario is going to run three times because this is scenario outline and multiple sets of data are provided. So three times the same scenario is going to run. So uh, I'll just take this uh, tag name and uh, I'll just uh, replace it here and run it. Same scenario is going to run three times because it is not scenario, it's scenario outline. You'll see the same running three times. First time it is running. You see, with second set of data it will run. Now with second set of data is going to run. Second set of username password, you can say. Now that's also done. Now third set of data also it's going to run. Third set of data also it's going to run. Done. You see the same scenario got run three times. Okay, as you can see here, the same scenario. Okay, login with valid credentials, login with valid credentials, login with valid credentials got run three times with the different sets of data. So hope guys, you got the answer for this question. That is what is the main difference between scenario and scenario outline. So scenario will run only one time, whereas scenario outline will run the number of times, the number of sets of data are mentioned under the examples keyword of the scenario outline scenario. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.